If you're wanting to get a deal on a house and get that money off the purchase price, if you love the house, stick with the house and let's ask for allowances. And instead of you backing out and not getting what you want, you get what you want and you get your money towards what you want. Right now you're able to ask for repairs. You're able to do a regular inspection. If you're interested in getting your closing costs covered and having any type of coverage at all in concessions, right now is a great time to do that. I knew you guys were here, and I knew you were here for a reason, because of this guy right here. Another question. Hey Derek, we see, that's not what that says. It says since. We sense a shift in the market. We're looking to buy a home in the next couple of months and are curious about what leverage we have as buyers. Ooh, that's a little bit of a change from what we normally talk about. How can we structure our offer to win? Parking spot? I'm sorry, did a parking spot ask this question? Does that say parking spot? Or does that say parking spa? Well, Mr. Parking. Uh, wait, is it a girl or a guy? So, if you're wanting to win an offer as a buyer right now in this market, where this market is shifting constantly in different directions that nobody really understands, it's okay, I got you covered. I got a few different things that you can do to structure your offer to win. Let's go talk about it now. I know you as buyers right now may feel a little small and have for a little while in this market, but guess what? Things are changing. Right now, you as a buyer are able to get a deal on a house. But how, Derek, how do you get a deal on a house in a market like this? Well, the market's shifting. And with that market shift, you as a buyer need to capitalize. Yes, the interest rate is higher. Yes, the purchase price is higher. But that brings me to my first point. You as a buyer right now have the ability to get money off of the purchase price. Right now, the asking price of any home is at an average about 6% higher than what it should be. So if you just take that 6% or even anything below 6%, at all off of the purchase price and offer that, there is a very high chance you're gonna get that because the average days on market right now is anywhere from 31 to 52 days. And that's just right now. And it's growing, that length of time on market is growing. So if you're wanting to get a deal on a house and get that money off the purchase price, and that's what's important to you and makes sense to you as a buyer, right now is the time to do that. So another thing that you can get right now is closing cost concessions. So what does that look like? Right now you have a down payment that you're required to do. It depends on if it's three and a half percent, 20%, 50%, it doesn't matter. You're gonna have some type of down payment that you need in order to purchase a home. Well, you have your closing costs that needs to be covered too. In the last few months and even the last couple of years, it's been no matter what, buyers covering their own closing costs. Well, with the shift in the market, you're actually able to negotiate some closing costs in there. I have a story where I have a new construction home that my client wanted to look at, loved the house and said, I want to offer 10 grand low. And I said, sure, no problem. Offer 10 grand low. I said, why don't we also see if we can get some concessions. Ended up getting 10 grand off of their closing cost as well. Because builders are wanting to get rid of their properties. They know that they're a little bit overpriced. They don't care because they know they're still going to get a killer deal on it, even if they have to drop price a little bit. So if you're interested in getting your closing cost covered and having any type of coverage at all in concessions, Right now is a great time to do that. So one thing that hasn't been around for a little while, especially because we've been in a seller's market, is what's called allowances. So you might go into a house and you say, oh my gosh, I love this house, Derek. It's beautiful, it fits everything I want, the rooms are the size I want, everything. But man, that pewter green color throughout the whole house is terrible. And then the bathroom's pink. I don't like that. I'm out on this house. Instead of doing that, let's take a step back and let's talk about allowances for paint. So you can get allowances for your paint color to change for painting in general. You can get allowances for your carpet. You can get allowances for flooring, allowances for a new roof. You can get allowances for anything. It just depends on what you need. So if there is paint or if there's cosmetic stuff like flooring and carpet that needs to be replaced, don't back out of the deal just because of that. If you love the house, stick with the house and let's ask for allowances. And instead of you backing out and not getting what you want, you get what you want and you get your money towards what you want. New carpet, new paint, new whatever. 
think about it. So, if you also look at a house and you're like, oh, I love this house, and you go under contract on it, and the repair list comes back, and there's a hundred things on it, and you're like, oh my gosh, this is so much stuff. What am I gonna do? It's okay. It's okay, because now in this market, we're back to instead of doing an inspection that's just on a pass or fail basis and you just accept the property as is because there's 50 offers on the house, we're done with that. Right now you're able to ask for repairs. You're able to do a regular inspection, ask for your repairs, just like normal, negotiate. Us as realtors are able to come back and negotiate like we're supposed to, that's what you pay us for, is to negotiate on your behalf, get you a good deal on the property, and make sure that you have peace of mind going into that property that you're not buying something that's about to fall over. Something that you can fix and make your home. If you as a buyer are interested in purchasing a home in a market like this where it's shifting and no one knows what's happening except for people like myself, most realtors should know what's going on right now. Uh, you know that you can probably get some pretty cool things when it comes to offering on your next house. Whether that's concessions, money off of your purchase price, it doesn't matter, allowances, everything. You have an option right now, you have the ability not only to do those things, but also find the house that you actually want. You don't have to settle, you can sit and look for a little while, because those houses are sitting on the market longer than normal. If you're interested in buying a house, watch this video, give me a call, I'd love to represent you on your next home purchase. See you guys. It's ball, y'all. <laughs> cool. Are we moving away again? I knew he didn't like it. All right, that's it right there? That's it right there? Is that it right there? Oh, hey. Oh. That was a red light. Oh. That was close. Urban Outfitters, oh wait, they went out of business. Did they really? Yeah, they started selling uh, shirts with real blood on them. Splattered. And it was like animal blood, and then it was a whole PETA thing, and that's yeah, fine. I'm like, should we do a photo? Should we just get like a photo, like a, since we're here and we're just waiting? Oh, okay. Well, that was kind of weird. Like, ah. <laughs> My feet okay? Maybe not. What's the what's the thing that I'm saying? What are we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> this one's for you, baby. Cool.